So when you pick the law of Iowa in one substantive issue and you pick the law of Colorado in another substantive issue, what's he saying? Um, you know, we're proud of this program. We really are. This is a really, really good program. It's a solid program. And um, I think that when our challenges with the ABA have given a misperception, I think, that maybe it's not a strong program, but it is a strong program. I mean, when it first came out, um, you know, we heard news that, that we'd been denied that provisional accreditation with the ABA. Um, that was candidly a surprise because uh, we had had, you know, lots of stuff going on. Like I said, the faculty's worked so hard, you know, pushing the curriculum and tweaking things here and there with an eye toward compliance uh, with all of those ABA rules. Um, so there was some talk initially. Uh, and with that said, you know, it's, it's sort of become a, like I said, just faded into a blur. It's there in the background and we monitor it, but it's not something that consumes the student body, I would think, as a whole. You know, I think we had all hoped that the ABA accreditation would happen. Um, and definitely there have been bumps along the road and we've all probably second guessed, you know, our decisions. Uh, but in the end, I know for a fact that I'm getting a top notch education here. It would be disingenuous to say that people don't think about uh, the accreditation challenges, but uh, we have an awful lot of positives as well. It's going to come up. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's sure. no way to avoid it. but. Uh, I think some people have, you know, different expectations and hopes for, you know, decisions from the ABA than others do, but in my cohort, the general consensus is that it doesn't matter because you can still practice in the state. I would say that, of course, you know, as law students, we all compare notes with other law students at other colleges and universities and law schools and so on and so forth. And I can tell you from the people that I know uh, at local law schools that our education here is on par or it actually exceeds what some of the local or in fact regional schools get. Uh, I'm not trying to make it sound like that we're, you know, cock of the walk here or anything like that, but we're definitely on par or um, I'd go so far as to say slightly ahead of some of the local or regional law schools? Even if you look at, as you have, if you look at the, um, the criticisms from the ABA, none of those criticisms uh, are with regard to the program of legal education. None of them. And, and we, have a, we have a great program here.